in all, we were on site for almost three years for the construction, um, building the first stage one, the, the new building, and then refurbishing uh, the existing Weihai facility. In that time, we had uh, two tar cranes erected, hundreds of tons of steel being delivered to the project, uh, almost a million man hours worked uh, over that period of time on the project, and uh, well over 2,200 people who've actually worked at one time or another on the, on the new facility. Well, the challenges on this project were, were significant. Um, I mean, it was a, it was a complex um, laboratory type uh, uh, structure. So there were, there were uh, technical challenges. Um, the program was an ambitious program. Uh, the facade was unique and different. Uh, and, um, and demanded a lot of uh, technical expertise. Um, what's important to us at Balderstone is, is that we form a very close relationship with our, with our client. Uh, that relationship here at Weihai was no exception. Very early in the project, we established that having really solid and good communication was vitally important. In addition on all Balderstone sites, and Weihai was no exception, a um, large portion of the materials removed from the site, be they uh, steel or, or timber, um, were recycled. Um, in addition to which on our, our site facilities we captured and treated uh, rainwater and surface runoff. So new technologies on this project included um, aluminium coated ceiling tiles in the laboratory areas, which are very important to increase uh, hygiene in the laboratories. And another initiative used on the project was the roof-mounted unirail system for uh, the ultimate cleaning of the project, which was provided in the in the atrium of the building, uh, which we, we call the monorail system. Uh, in addition to that, there was also LED lighting was undertaken in the building, um, and also the building management system provided by Siemens was what we would call state-of-the-art. The other great challenge we had on this job was ensuring that uh, the operation here at Weihai continued during the construction of the new facility. That's a major um, uh, and technical and laboratory process had, had to continue while we did the construction. We achieved that through very close communication with everybody involved, but particularly with our key stakeholders, the staff here at, at Weihai, to ensure that all of the movements required, trucks, cranes, bringing in materials, all happened but minimised the disruption on the operating facility of Weihai.